Hey guys and welcome back to another follow-up video on our gaming computer upgrade and actually this will be the last individual review and it will be about the MSI GTX 950 which is well not here but right over here and that being said let's go straight for the video hope that you guys enjoy it and I'll see you in a few seconds. So here we are with the MSI GTX 950 with 2GB of GDDR5, base clock of 1076MHz with turbo boost up to 1253MHz, 128-bit memory interface and CUDA core count of 768. And regarding our usual quick unboxing experience, once we open the package we will find a user guide, a CD with drivers which honestly I didn't use as I downloaded them from the web and the 950 that on my opinion looks awesome. And now taking a closer look at it. At the front we will find that really nice single fan cooler which we will talk about the noise level later on on the video at the back a really nice black pcb on the top the msi logo and the six pin power connector nothing special to see on the right side but here's a close-up anyway and on the left side one display port 1.2 one hdmi 2.0 one dual link dvid and one dual link dvii and let's go straight for some benchmarks and right now i'm gonna leave you guys just for a few seconds and please have in mind that i don't own the gtx 750 50 anymore so in some comparison charts it will not be present. And so after all those benchmarks and before we move on to the conclusion just a few notes one of which is that although the GTX 760 is still superior the 950 is reaching some nice results. Also to note that reaching those results on the 950 draws a lot less power than on the 760. And finally I would also like to mention that the 950 at idle it's a bit more noisy than the dead silent 760 but while on gaming the 950 is actually more silent and of course we can change the fan curves to our tasting but all the tests were done with the default settings. So in conclusion guys, things that I did like the most were the white cooler that looks awesome on a white build, the performance and power consumption balance, the small form factor and finally it's reasonably silent while on gaming. On the other hand, things that I did like the less were just one and it is that the fan at idle should spin a bit lower than the default 42% or 1500 RPM so that it could be totally silent like the AVGA 760. And that is it regarding the MSI GTX 950. Hope that you guys enjoyed the video and if you did so don't forget that usual thumbs up. My name is Roberto George and as always I'll see you on the next one.